This is Pink Savannah. A fashion and accessories brand specializing in the manufacture and exportation of Kenyan-made brass jewelry. Located in Parklands, Nairobi County, the company is the brainchild of two sisters, Glenna and Gliza, who founded the business out of a love for craftsmanship. I would used to make um, friendship bracelets for my friends, so our dad gave us our first pliers, where we started making earrings on my mom's living room floor. We actually changed her whole living room to our studio and making jewelry on the floor. So we started off making um, earrings and then obviously um, increased our units into like earrings, bracelets, necklaces and, and, and what have you. And that's how Pink Savannah came up. It's inspirational, obviously the beauty of Kenya, its nature in the wild. Our brass is locally sourced from um, art centers um, either in Kibera, Dandora or um, Rongai. And we support art centers and youth who cast our brass. So we do the designs, they cast it for us, they bring it back and then we assemble our items. So then we also use a mixture of materials. We use uh, cow horn, cow bone, um, reclaimed wood from furniture shops that they discard, so we take it over and then obviously our artisans um, shape it to what we, we um, design. Currently, the co-owners have been able to successfully export their products to various parts of the globe. So we've done UK, the US and Dubai. Luckily enough we have DHL in Kenya and the good thing is when, when someone orders from abroad they pay the shipping um, and, and all of that. So for us we have used about DHL and TN TNT for which, is, which are great courier services. But how easy was it breaking into the international scene? Actually not easy, first of all. <laughs> because getting your stuff out there, because you need to be out there to show your products. So luckily enough, we had a little bit of budget to take part in some of the trade shows out there. We had done a trade show um, here locally where they um, invited um, international buyers. We've done one in London. In addition to this, Programs like She Trades also play an important role in helping Kenyan businesses reach global markets. So they're actually a platform. So they guide you with the course on how to start exporting so that they've been a great help to us as well because they actually narrow down all your challenges on what you can um, do. So with about six years of exporting experience under her belt, Glenna is confident that Kenya has a lot to offer when it comes to global trade, a fact that she plans to take full advantage of. I think for us, showing that we are capable of having good quality products made in Kenya and the fact that we've got uh, resources, you know, in terms of how a product is made and uh, great craftsmanship because um, that's what your brand is all about. I think there's a great market for the African and obviously Kenyan products. And that's Kenya to the world. My name is Michael Zimanji. <laughs>